to show you how to play Only You by the Flying Pickets. If you want the letter notes for that, you go to letternoteplayer.com. I have them there for you. So we're going to go open up. I'm going to be on a piano pad setting. It'll give me a little percussive effect, but it'll have some sustain with it. So all I'm going to do is A flat and E flat, and you can play them together if you want. I like to arpeggiate them. And I like to put a C back up there. It's like another voice coming in. And then we go into the melody. I was rushing the intro a little bit, so you want to hold back on this. C, 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 D flat, C, B flat, A flat, A flat, G, A flat, G, F, D flat, C, C, B flat. And in your bass, you're going to go A flat, E flat, G, F, C, E flat, D flat, A flat. And then you can either go to an E flat there, I've got it written both ways, but I like to go to an A flat. E flat. It sounds better to go to an A flat chord and to the E flat chord. So you're going to walk the bass down. And we'll put an A flat, E flat as a cadence right there. So here we go. the chorus and we're going to play the choruses right here on a D flat C D flat C B flat B flat C B flat C B flat A flat A flat A flat D flat C B flat A flat B flat D D flat C A flat here's the chorus Back and forth between the D flat, open fifth, A flat, B, E flat, B flat, and then we'll walk it down. Back to the D flat, E flat, A flat, B flat, C. Now you can either play that with your left hand, or you can play it and cheat with your right hand, because you're gonna you can just have that C played with the right hand. So now the chorus together. you can you can just roll that E flat B flat E flat it's up to you on that and you can just hold it in the chorus again now here I'm going to roll that up to an F this time I'm going to roll all the way up it sounds cool to go D flat A flat F and then do the G, E flat, B flat, G. So you're going E flat, B flat, G. And the way I do that is with my little finger, my middle finger, and then my thumb. So I'm going to go. And you can put it, you can synchronize it right with the melody. if you want to. If you, I would play it twice. Because they've got little pauses at the end of each phrase there where they'll just have a little bit of bump bumps in there. And then we've got... So those 
notes are C, A flat, E flat, C, D flat, C, A flat, F, D flat, C, A flat, F, F, E flat, F, D flat, C, A flat, C, and C. The first time you go on down to the E flat, the second time. back up to the C. So you go D flat C, A flat C, B flat. And I'm going to try to hold them down and, and not play them too fast if I can. Now when you go to the F, you're going to have to change from an A flat and an E flat to an A flat and a D flat. We're going from an A flat chord to a D flat chord, but all I'm going to do is I'm going to change one note. So I'm going to go. And then we come right in with the vocal design. So that's that's what you've got right there. You've got And if you want to arpeggiate it, you can. You can go It's going to mess you up. You can arpeggiate it if you want to, but it's probably going to mess you up your finger and if you just hit those and hold them. Then we're right back into D flat, A flat, F. is more of the same leading into the tag. There it's a little changed because they changed the change the melody right there so they got D flat C B flat C and then quick D flat C B flat and into the chorus and the tag and we're gonna go back to the D flat A flat F So it ends just the way you began it. There you have it, by the flying pickets, only you.